Well, if your workout has become ho hum and you're dreading the gym thanks to exercise boredom, well, why not hit the streets? Well, don't forget your parachute. <laughs> Leave it to Cindy to help us uh, up our running game and help us soar right through a fun workout. In today's workout Wednesday, Cindy shows us the benefits of running with a parachute. I just want to change up running, you know, because if you are a runner, if you want to add running into your workout, it's going to do something different besides just the normal run. It becomes boring. So, you know, maybe you're an athlete and you're trying to increase your speed because you're training for a marathon or maybe you're training for a triathlete. So just to increase speed, we're going to have a parachute behind us today. Fun time. Um, so what it is, it's almost going to be like you're running through water. Okay, you know how have you ever tried to run in water? It's hard. It's a slower motion. It's going to have a little drag, and it's going to slow things down to where you've got some resistance going against you. So my goal is to get this up in the air? In the air. Or behind, just behind It's going to be behind you in the air. I will take it even like this high you above will. the ground. Oh, you're so nice. Okay. okay. So, um, how much does this weigh, would you say? Um, so we can get people to understand this that. weighs like nothing. Nothing. Okay. nothing. And if you have a partner, see this little, and you can hold it yourself as well. If you want to just hold it up, mm -hmm. get you running, you can do it by yourself. But that seems like you're kind of not it, doing the real it thing. It works. It works. Okay. Yeah, it works. So um, let me make sure I'm not tangled here. Okay, ready? Go. There you go. You got it. Woo! Good job, Callie Jones. But now, on the return, we got the wind going against us. So, which means that parachute's going to go a little higher, a little bit more resistance. You ready? Okay, I'm ready. All right. And keep my arms down. Yeah. Really work on your arm movement because the less energy that you're expending there, the more energy you can use in your legs. One, two, three. Go. Awesome. Go, 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 go. It was a good workout, right? It was. It's very good. It was a good workout. It's well known I'm not a runner, but that puts more oomph in your workout. It makes it fun. It is fun. It makes it fun. And I know people get all intimidated with the parachute. But you know, you, you got this big balloon <laughs> behind you and you know that you gotta get it off the ground so it makes you run faster. And you're not a runner, so you know, getting out there it wasn't that bad for you. It was a great day. Can't like, be beautiful. Get outside. And I got a high five from Cindy. <laughs> Good job. <laughs> Good. Thank bad. you, thank you. So you can find a lightweight, inexpensive parachute at your nearest sporting goods store. If you have questions about this workout, your workout, what you want to do, go to our uh, Local 15 Facebook page and live chat with Cindy Ross right now. I think we need a race between you two and a parachute. She would win. Yeah. I, I am not good at running. Uh, I you did play soccer, though. But did you? I did. No, that's your, like, premiere right there. That's a, that's a great athlete. That was in high school. Still. <laughs> we won't say how long ago that can was. Can I just tell you, though, um, I was thinking about eating. Like, that was what was getting me through. Like, go <laughs> on, I can go get this. My favorite sandwich. No, that was, it really worked out every muscle. Mm -hmm. You saw me the next day. Right. I was yeah, you walking. were a little bit sore. A lot of bit sore. Yeah. I'm okay with it though. <laughs> that looks good. I love Cindy.